struggling cat because it's my first time to visit here in Jordan's Mill. Pero right now, I have a special friend because she lives nearby and she's a Buana. Please welcome a very special guest who will tell me about this place. My lovely Bori friend, Eve. Due to the strong wind, she will not be able to hear what Eve is saying, but she's explaining that this place has been opened by His Royal Highness, Prince Charles, and that's why we're so excited to be here. Eve, right now, I'm going to put my long way behind Kekaron. Si Buano, pwede ta mag-iniring din hi sa Jordan's Bill. Are you ready? Budagal at tayo. And you know what? We're looking at the Jordan's family home, right? Yeah. So we're looking at the home where the Jordan's family started the business. What do they sell? Is it the cereals? Uh, yeah, the, the, you know the Jordan cereals? Yes. Yes. You've the, seen around and all that. So they actually don't make it here anymore in this um, factory. They do it on the um, other side of the A1, ah. which is part owned by the Rivita. I love Raivita. I used to have some Raivita food with me. So right now, we're gonna tour you to the beautiful gardens and of course on the circle place right here in Jordan. I will the view of the garden. Pura mag mga iring. Ang amok pagka iring will be so amazing. So let's go! Let's go, let's go. So, your journey of exploring this beautiful Jordan's meal starts here with this map. Why? It gives you an idea where you get to go around. My amiga Eve here. What's your favorite space in here, Eve? Dayang Garden. Garden, it's good. Really nice. Really? Of course, excited to have a garden. Kaya ano bito? So na ko. Excited na kung garden. Kami ni Eve isuroy suroy ko niya. Kaya ano bito? Mas nindot pa kung tingin niya. Sige magbinuri niya. Cat. Sige. Kita kita tama because now it's time for us to see the wonderful places right here in Jordan's Mill. This is the fascinating story about the people and the events behind the last working flour mill in Bedfordshire. A story of innovation and survival as home mills continues to keep our food heritage alive to this day. The family has had a connection with the mill at home, a hamlet in Bedfordshire tucked away on the River Ival for over 150 years. As the sixth William Jordan to have had a hand in its running, we thought it was about time that the family history and the mill story were captured. The Williams below had did an excellent job of being enterprising and adapting with the times, keeping the mill operational through the good times and bad. The generation moved the family firm away from the milling flour to create their own range of breakfast cereals and cereal bars. However, it seemed a fitting tribute to keep one of the last working roller mills in the country, a fine example of Victorian technology preserved for future generations. Hello! So, well, right now, I am going to explore the, we'll go to the, the riverside and then the wood and yeah. then the river cafe. But right now, as you can see, all of the beds here are not out because it's still early spring. But we will come back again next time to show you when all of the gardens are filled with beautiful flowers. And yeah. this will be such a beautiful place. To In April 2013, the Jordans Trust, a charitable trust founded to renovate the mill, opened Jordans Mill, a brand new visitor center and cafe on the banks of the River Ival. Alongside the original mill building, the mill can now be seen again in all its working glory through the special guided tours. Tarsa. 
Tarzan. I like it under the weeping willow. Man, Tarzan, don't gonna die. <laughs> Hello! Ni Ana Mi, ga socially distance me. Ga sayo sayo mi nga risa kahanginon. With a weeping willow, ga laki lak siya. Mura sa unta mi nga wala diri oi. Oh. Hindot pa makini at ki at og ulay tao. Diri daw si Eve, ga hindi ka ga picnic din ni Eve. Hindi ba kita yung panty? Ako, ako rin kakita. Guys, you can have picnics here. And it's really nice when the weather is nice. Yeah. So, kami, we're under the weeping willow, which is my favorite tree. It's so romantic. Kung mag-date pito mo di Rino, kinahanglan, kung ang gabi ipa, di rin makita o na mo himuhon. Ayaw lang kung ambak sa suba. Oo, kayo gano'n. Huwag mo ambak mo aning sapa di rin. Ay, prasa ako abasing mahimo mong serena. <laughs> Kaya nga no, bitaw, mahimo mong serena di rin na makuratan yun mo nga kalitla na ay sokoy nga migawas. <laughs> Moni, huwag may mahimo di rin. Kami ni Eve nakita mi sa Daplin sa Paksa dito sa Bedford. Pinaka years na ka to Eve. Yes! Mga, yeah! Eight years na. Oh, mga 8-10 years na. Mga bata pa mi ato karon mga tiguang pero sexing kurap. <laughs> In he in Jordan Smell. Yeah. This is the Kalasangan Teresa Jordan Smell. If you are going to have a date here, perfect time for walking, taking friends around, and it's so romantic because you are beside River Ivel. <laughs> well, you can see Eve oh, pura sa chak weeping willow, burikat ka ayo. Kaya nga nabitaw sa Sambuanga, di ba doon mo sa Dakak? Yes! Huwag mo ako ato sa Dakak, pero... Sige, mauban ko niyo mo sa pagbiga-biga. Kaya nga nabitaw, hindi ko biga-biga. Pero karoon, di nisa ta sa ato kabukiran. Di nisa ta sa ato kabukiran. Our own Lasal. So Tarzan and Jane, here in Jordan's Mill. Maraming mga iring, maraming iring pundatan. Ay, nangawala ta. We're going on the nature trail now. We're going to the woods. Yes, so we're off to the the wood trail section here because you know what we love anything that's closer to nature Mona nga ako po perfect siya despite 5 degrees lang siya diri exciting ka ayun nature oh my god look at the beautiful look tanawa mong beautiful place ala ikaw ang mudagandagan magkapakapakain it's so exciting diri Marag mag, maganahan mag binuang. Kaya nga na bitaw, wag binuang bitaw mo, no? Life is so exciting. Bisag among life there sa England tayo. Karun, we're gonna sit down there, kaya no? Feeling na mo, marag mag-date-date lang. Ha! 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 The Jordan's Mill is a food heritage attraction situated on the banks of the River Ival in Biggleswade. You can come here and take a guided tour of the historic Victorian mill and admire the ingenuous milling machinery while the tour guides take you on a fascinating journey through time. You can explore the beautiful mill gardens with their crops of cereals, fruits and vegetables growing alongside ornamental flowers and plants which can all be grown at home. And you can also enjoy the wildlife and tranquility of the meadow and the woodland. Then, relax in at the River Cafe where you can enjoy freshly prepared food and drink overlooking the stunning views of the River Ival. Oh my god! I challenge my friend Eve to go to this one. La. Go, go, go! I'm ah! <laughs> Perfect 10. <laughs> Perfect 10. Perfect 10. Because it ring. Wonderful. <laughs> Hello. Excited, cool. Because I'm trying to try this trail. 
How good am I? Should I do it? Go, like go, go. <laughs> Obstacle course. Gymnast, we're a gymnast, Dion. Pack. We're a gymnast. 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 We're a Hello, so this is the Jordan store where earlier I showed you the mill and the sites although the mill is closed for a year now because of the pandemic and we're waiting for the time for that to be reopened so that I can take you inside and show you how they prepare all of these lovely products like the fruit and nut muesli they have the crunchy oats granola and I used to buy some of their bars like this one I used to take this to the workplace and if you buy here it's much cheaper than buying it from the store because maybe it comes from their own factory and it's more exciting. So as you walk here, you get to see some gluten-free products that they get to sell. And all of the vegetables and the kind of things that they put in their sandwiches are taken from their own gardens here. So it's really kind of a pest-free and it's really good because they take care of the environment. It's a good way to really enjoy products coming from their own gardens. Right here in Jordan's Mill. I'm so glad to have made it. And it's not so busy, although six people are allowed. There's about five people of us in here right now. And I'm enjoying the little visit here at this lovely store. So if you can drop by, please do, because it's a perfect place to buy products like me and like you who love breakfast cereals and all the other things. Oh, I love that one. Oh my god! Let me Anthony. I'm only some favorite to come. I visit a couple of una. I live in the Germany. They're not pakao. They're not sila. Why? Because they're not locally produced product. But if you're pakao, you can hang down. You're not on to any postizo. Kita ang kita karang sa buo. Basi bala pakao mo on to mo na kaya na kao. So be careful, ka. Now several products and several kinds of foods can I eat? Gusto ko bala ako na lang mo ato sa Jordan. Bye, Jordan. <laughs> Bye, local. Standing here by the River Eiffel, which connects you to the River Ouse later on, but at the moment, the beautiful views here are just incredible. As we explore more of the sites outside Jordan's Mill. You know what? Kung na ako sa mga places like this, muragit ko ikatan nga ili. Nga no bitaw, pwede ko makatkat-kat-kat sa kahoy. Kaya lahat kayo kumagpa-stretch. Ay, ba't sinakita lang to akong puso? But you know what? When you get to the water's edge, you can have a date here. Picnic by the River Eiffel. Yes. Just put your mats and imagine kung summer ni siya, mas gana kay mong view dere. That's why it's such a beautiful place to stay. To all of my friends and to all my kurings, there will be more exciting places I shall show to all of you. So wait lang mo kay wag muni muni sa ako. Pachada. So time for a little coffee break now here in the Southern Place and it's really great to just have a break after seeing this lovely mill site and now it's time for us to enjoy and as you can see all those vitality centers in the UK are still closed you can only order for takeaway 
but hopefully soon in the most in a couple of weeks this will buzz again when people are allowed to eat indoors and that moment is something that we all just can't wait Mwah. So here we are, we have really enjoyed our mini tour and I would like to thank Eve for treating me to this lovely deluxe chocolate. Let me taste it. Alright, I'm beauty. <laughs> it's really lovely to have a tour. Even if the museum is closed, we managed to go to the store and get to know some of the products that they sell here. And to Eve, akong amiga, salamat kayo for finding the time to join me here. Although next time we're gonna come back to do barbecue here and we will do more machika right here in yeah. Jordan's Mill. To all of you and to all of my lo lovely followers, I love you and please continue to follow my vlog because there's more happiness coming your way. Thank Cheers you. everybody! Well, it was quite cold today. But despite that the sun was out, but I wasn't able to show you everything about Jordan's mill. We will come back to you when everything is open so that you get to see how the mill operates and of course when it's buzzing. But despite that, I have given you a glimpse of how this one place. I would like to thank my friend Eve for inviting me to be here. And now I'm looking forward for my next adventure. So join me because there's more to come as we revisit this again next time. Right here in Jordan's mill with Jessica. To all of my Korings, I love you. Yeah.